coming to see the show tomorrow. I'm Mike Tyson at the Air Canada Center. Mr. Tyson. Excuse me? What did you say? You got the two of you out here, Mr. Mayor. Come on, you got to come with Mike Tyson. Mr. Tyson. Mike, what brings you out here today? We're good, we're good. We want to take the crowd. We're right here. That's it. Okay? Sir, sir, just look forward. Just, that's it. I'm worried. <laughs> just look forward. That's perfect. Why did you come and see the marathon? Well, I'm a big fan of the man, like most Americans are. And um, I just went, I had the opportunity to meet him, and I just took advantage of the opportunity. Why are you a fan of Mayor Forbes? Well, because the mayor is, um, he's dealt with, well, life is dealt with. We all overcome adversity, you know. We really can't even understand the concept of happiness if we don't overcome adversity. We would just be um, constantly, perpetually sad. The reason we are happy is because we overcome something that was very difficult in life. Is this a good PR stunt for you, though, to get some attention for your show? Well, I don't need any PR, really. But I don't know. I'm just happy to meet you. Mr. Tyson, do you have any advice for the mayor today? Hey, no, I'm just happy to be here. I'm not here to give nobody any advice. I'm not no authority and giving good advice by that manner. Did he give you advice? Excuse me? Did he give you advice? <laughs> He said, "Be careful! They're all, they're gonna pop you outside." See? I told you, buddy. Thank Guys, we're here. Man. We're here to promote the show tomorrow night. Mike Tyson is giving his first performance ever in Canada, and this is a real treat to have him. And we're honored that we came to see another survivor, Mr. Rob Ford. Okay, thanks. All right. Well, I'm sure I'm not the only celebrity that comes here that want to meet the mayor. The mayor is a celebrity in his own right. And um, he's a very interesting guy. Mr. Mayor, do you think this is a good idea for you? Is this good PR for you, Mr. Mayor, during the election? Yeah, absolutely. Why not? I idolize this him since I'm 19 years old, 18 years old. How old are you, man? I'm 45. <laughs> <laughs> so we're almost the same age, and you were fighting and knocking out guys at a very young age. So Mike, we're cut from the same cloth. There's no nonsense, and I, you know, that's uh, that's why I respect him and. Um, I wish him all the best. He's good straight up. Could you take him, Mr. It's funny. Mayor? No. Well, he did say he could <laughs> he take said, him. Yeah, yeah. Remember one of those, uh, <laughs> one of those <laughs> accidental tirades of his? He, he, he did say that he would kick my butt. <laughs> oh, you don't remember? Oh, you know, you're not following, <laughs> following the mayor. Oh, oh they follow me, Chester. But in, in all seriousness, is, in all seriousness, <laughs> Mr. Mayor, this man has, you have a troubled past that you have fully acknowledged. You know what, guys? Is and you guys are perfect. Is it good you know what? No. You, and you know what? No, no. Hold on a second. You know what bothers me? But then again, no. Listen. Let my Tyson um, answer this question. Please. He has a troubled path because we have uh, he has 24 hour surveillance of the press. So it's our fault. So no, it's right. not his fault. It's just that he's living his life and we're human beings. We have no idea what you do <laughs> behind closed doors or what your um, habits are. Anybody else habits are. Not no, that's not, but you're human beings. Does that mean that we could take shots at people? Or do you prefer him to be a guy that's clean cut, but behind the door you never know what he's doing? That's right. That's what people prefer. That's, that's what human beings have a problem with, being real with themselves. This is who I am. Or I'm not that person, but I look good in, I look good in, the, private, in, the, in the public world, but behind closed door I'm really a smug. And that's what we want. That's really what Americans, that's what people want, you know, in our society. We want them to look good, but to be bad. And um, we all make mistakes as a human being. He's no different than anybody else. At least that's what I believe, of course.